Welcome once again to The Breakfast uh, on uh, PLOS TV Africa. Now let's go back in history, um, not very long ago actually, uh, this day in the year 2018. Um, once again, Nigerians woke up to news of the loss of about 55 uh, uh, people after a market row in Kaduna State. It was in 2018, the sectarian fighting between Muslim and uh, Christian youths that led to the death of 55 people at Kosuwan uh, Magani in uh, uh, Kaduna, I believe. Sectarian violence was sparked by a spat at the market. 55 people died. Muslim and Christian youths clashed um, uh, after um, um, wheelbarrow reporters, I believe, in the town. Um, oh, I think it was, uh, if I remember the story well enough, it was a wheelbarrow pusher who claimed to be assaulted by another person, and that sparked a religious Muslim-Christian battle in the market. 55 lives were eventually uh, lost that day, and authorities eventually then had to impose a round-the-clock curfew in the state. 22 people were arrested. Um, of course, uh, we're not sure exactly what happened to those 22 people that were arrested, if any of them has been found, uh, tried and found guilty of um, any of these murders or any of these killings. But it was on this day, that Nigeria lost 55 uh, people to that um, uh, clash in uh, Kasua Magani in Kaduna State. Stay with us. When we come back, we're going straight into uh, discussions for today, the NSARS Memorial. What really has changed since October 2020? We're going to be having the guests join us both in the studio and virtually. We'll be back.